This is the most popular dynamic programming question at every single company. So given an array of integers which represent the stock price for each of the days, return the maximum profit that we can generate from at most two transactions. In order to generate a profit, we need to buy and sell a stock. So let's say we buy at zero and sell at four, we generate a profit of four. Let's say we're given the following example. If we can only perform two transactions, we can buy at zero, sell at three, buy at one, and then sell at four to generate a maximum profit of six. Let's go over the dollar process. At each of the indices, we have two choices. We can either buy or sell. When our state is buy, we have two choices. We can either skip the stock or buy the stock. We will pick the choice that will give us the higher profit. And lastly, when our state is sell, we have two choices. We can either skip the stock or sell the stock. We will pick the choice that will give us the higher profit. Let's go over the code, create our two variables to indicate buy and sell. Let's implement the function max profit taking input prices, return the result of the helper method. Now let's implement the helper method taking the current index, the state, the number of transactions and prices. If our index is out of bound or transactions is equal to zero, return zero. If our state is buy, return the larger profit between buying and skipping the stock, else return the larger profit between selling and skipping the stock. 